The following contest is an Extreme Rules match. Making his way to the ring from Punjab, India, weighing in at 451 pounds, the great Ali. Guys, this match has the potential to completely change the WWE landscape, and it's because of this level of talent involved. A victory tonight over Damian Priest not only protects his career, but supercharges his superstardom. Here comes a reckoning. The archer of infamy, ready to pass judgment. And his opponent, representing the Judgment Day from New York, New York, weighing in at 249 pounds, Damian Priest. No longer cares for the WWE Universe, no longer cares for the rest of the locker room. Come on, let's go. Because he has found his true family, and the Judgment on, Day is their name. Multiple title reigns in his career already, but Priest wants even more. And there's nobody who can stand in his way. This Iron Man match is underway, a true test of the amount of determination and perseverance in a superstar. This is a match that can literally come down to one point. Every single second of an Iron Man match is important and should be used wisely. Now, tracking the opposition. Stumps. That was a showing of control and aggression, something they'll want to keep up. He should have known that wasn't enough. Ripcord applied. Boom! Knock him down. Ouch. Oh, that attack was definitely pre-calculated, hoping to greatly diminish the power in that arm. Pretty stable to adapt. Just carrying the opposition anywhere they want. Ooh, they're pulling the trick here. With all the destruction, with all the carnage, Byron, is there a key to victory in something like this? There cannot be any hesitation to do what you've got to do. You have to be aggressive and stay on the attack. That's what it's all about. Pull out all the stops, dig down deep, do what you have to do. This takes strength, speed, and innovation. And don't forget about a merciless mean streak. Looking for something here. Wait a minute. Hoist it up. Oh, my goodness. Draped across the barricade. Reversal. What a counter. Oh, man. Check out this power. Priest dodges out of that. Defenses are sharp in this series of reversals. Oh! 
Scoop slam. Wow. What elevation. He's taking some good hits. And Priest spins him off. Side and back to the mat. What's he open to find down there? He's got a kendo stick, a weapon we've seen used to great effect time and time again. Oh, back elbow. Damian Priest would like to be your guy. Sound of heaven choke slam. Priest had him on Dream Street. Maneuver is absolutely amazing. That was close, but Damian Priest doesn't look like he's letting that distract him from the task at hand. Big clothesline. Boot to the most effective way to counter any attack. One response after another. Back and forth we go. Talk about dismantling your opponent. Seemed to be pretty easy. Oh, I don't think Priest knows what's coming. Uh -oh. He saw it coming, taking advantage. Oh, that hurt right to the kidney. Golly. Uh oh. level performance from these competitors tonight. They've shown a lot of resiliency. You have to give them that. Oh, that's just disrespect right there. I kind of like it. And Priest with the wherewithal to counter. As the arm bar stretch in. The stretch at the arm. The submission is in. He could be up. On oh, the elevated triangle. And that is a great way to get out of it. Couple body shots all it took. Oh! Oh dear, this 
Doesn't look good. Ouch. That's one way to get your opponent out of the corner. And we see the attention being put on the torso area. He deflects it right back. Military press! Oh. He had it! Did that put his priest off? Oh my, still alive! I don't know what type of dark forces Damian Priest called on there, but it worked. I think there is still some shock in the air over the fact that that didn't produce a pinfall.